Whether you grew up on it or watched your children grow up on the show, the award-winning Bear in the Big Blue House that aired on the ABC was a show that was loved by children and adults around the world. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Big Blue House. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Big Blue House. Door is open. Come on in. Now you're here, so let's... With Bear in the Big Blue House now available to watch on Disney Plus Australia, it's a huge honour to welcome to the show the man behind, inside and out, the performer, puppeteer of Bear himself, the very talented Noel McNeil. Noel, welcome to the show. Hello, Troy. <laughs> yeah. How are you? Very good, my friend. How does it feel, Noel, having Bear finally at a home on Disney Plus? Uh, it's a lesson in never say never, because I never thought that this show would be uh, brought back. And so I was actually in the park on my birthday, and I was walking through, and somebody texted me, oh, congratulations, on Bear at Disney Plus. And immediately I thought, what? And I went to three, three different websites, and just to see if this was actually true, and it turned out it was. And so that's when I uh, sat down and did this little TikTok video to announce. And being on TikTok, I've done all kinds of like little videos as myself with my puppet of bear. So it's a puppet of a puppet, which is very meta. But <laughs> I thought, let me just sit down and just do this little announcement. And so I sat there and I, all I said was, I'll be quick. Guess what's finally coming to Disney Plus October 19th? And that was it. It was like, to this day, over 3 million people have seen this. And thousands of people have liked it and shared it and marked it as their favourites. 25 years ago is when Bear in the Big Blue House started, which is, which is impo- well, it's hard to comprehend that it was that long ago because it doesn't feel that long. I remember watching it for the first time on, on our ABC TV here in Australia. Do you remember a lot of working on the show? Oh yeah, absolutely. So this was the this was our opportunity to this be our show and to create these characters for this show. And so when we were doing this, we were just having fun, and we really had no idea of the longevity, like the lasting impression this would have. We knew that kids liked it because as the seasons went on, we would have kids come and visit the set, and it got so popular to the point where during the fourth season. We actually would, every two weeks, um, like on a Wednesday, we would uh, start rolling cameras at 9, and then at, and we'd get what we could get. And then at 10 o'clock, we would stop for like half an hour. And that's when the kids who had been invited could come through. And it became, it became sort of like its own little like Disney attraction, where they would start at one end of the set and like work their way through the attic and the otter pond and the kitchen until finally they got to the living room and there was Bear on the swing. But by the time the, the, the family got to Bear and then said goodbye, as they were leaving the studio, they got a copy of it to take with them so that as a little uh, remembrance. So we knew kids like loved the show. And it was a great way to remind ourselves of this is why we're doing it. This is, this is why we're here. But we had no idea how long lasting this was be. During the early days of the pandemic, I used Bear to help kids and people, you know, learn that you need to wash your hands and you should sing a song mm. for like 20 seconds. So I used the goodbye song as an example of that and used Bear and myself as examples. During these difficult times, remember two things. One, wash your hands for 20 seconds and sing a song while you're doing it. Goodbye, goodbye, good friends, goodbye. Cause now it's time to go But hey, I say, well that's okay Cause we'll see you very soon, I know Very soon, I know And two, no matter what You are still smelling really good Well, this got so much attention and, and went viral that BBC World News interviewed me oh, wow. <laughs> about this effect yeah. and how, you know, trying to help kids through this, like, incredibly difficult time. It, it, it's really it's really sweet that 
people still resonate with this this character. And now the fact that a whole new generation is seeing it. In fact, the, the original generation that grew up on Bear, some of them have kids now and are introducing their children to the show they grew up with. And they're posting reactions of their kids watching the same episodes that they watch. I think it's not to take all the credit, but I think it's sort of helped prime the pump that now that Bear is back on Disney Plus, like people have, I mean, during the whole pandemic and up until it was announced, people kept asking, like, please, Disney, put it back on. Please put this back on. I want to see this again. I want to share this with my kids. I need this again. And so finally that it happened, it's like perfect timing. The show ran for four seasons over, I think it was 120 something episodes. Is that right? Like 116 episodes. 16. Yeah. There we go. Do you have a favorite yeah. episode or a favorite scene that is just oh. unforgettable? Wow. There are like so many great moments from the series. One of my favorite episodes is actually the one I got to direct. Mm. And it's the one where Bear is hardly in the episode. It's called Volunteers of Woodland Valley. When you volunteer, you're helping folks in your community. And there are all kinds of ways to volunteer. For example, some folks, like me, joined the Volunteer Fire Department. Oh, hey there. But there are ways you can volunteer in your community. For example, for your school, you could collect canned food. Or you could collect toys for kids who don't have any. Or you could clean up your park. Whatever you do to volunteer, you're getting to know folks and places in your community better. And the best part? It makes them and you feel really great. In it, Bear is going to go out and volunteer within the town of Woodland Valley that he and his friends live in. But he hurts his foot. And so Pip and Pop and Ojo and Trilo and Tutter go and do his, his uh, volunteer work. Pip and Pop and Tutter go to story time at the library and Odro and Trilo go to the firehouse to help clean the fire truck. And so this was an episode that had to be specially written so that Bear wasn't in every scene the way he is in every other episode. And so it was, it was very fun. And it was, it was a great song that I got to um, direct in a call to clean up the truck. Mm. And so I, I did that. And I, it was the first time I actually like, formally like directed and I, I really like the feeling like oh i'd like to do this again is there any chance that we might see <laughs> new content from bear and his friends in the big blue house well funny you should say that troy because um when when bear was put on disney plus uh it started to trend it's trended here in the united states and it's trended in the uk and so that's when i did another little tiktok that to date has gotten almost 300,000 views. And I've just said that Bear is Bear in the Big Blue House is trending on Disney Plus. Thank you so much. Like, first and foremost, it wouldn't be doing this unless you all were watching. So thank you so much. And then I say, now here's the thing. Disney notices what's trending on Disney Plus. And, and Disney will think, well, if they like watching it at home, maybe they'd like to have a similar experience in the parks. And then I asked the viewer, would you want to see Bear and his friends back in the Disney parks? Because they were part of um, Disneyland and Disney World with their, with their own show. And then I said, and also Disney Plus notices what's trending. And they think, well, if people like this, maybe they'd like some newer content, maybe some shorts based on this, or maybe even a new original Disney Plus movie and then I asked the viewers, would you want to see new short content or even an original Disney Plus movie with Bear and his friends? I would. And people have just been commenting down the boards, yes, 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 yes. But it's all good. I actually did an interview with um, last week with D23 and Disney Plus and have said the same thing. And they, they were 
quite enthused. So we'll, we'll see what happens. <laughs> fingers crossed. Bear in the Big Blue House is now available to stream on Disney+. Plus. Do yourself a favour. Do your kids a favour. Uh, stream it and watch it as many times as possible so we get to get new Bear content. Noel, again, thank you so much. It's been an honour right. chatting with you today. Thank you, everybody. And as Bear would say, you are all smelling really good out there. The Troy Murphy Show.